Hey, what's going on everyone? My name is Magic and welcome back to my channel. Now today we're we'll talking about who the elders are in Black Ops 3 Zombies. Now let's start off by talking about the fact that Shadows of Evil is based off the Cthulhu Mythos, which is a fictional universe based on the writings of H.P. Lovecraft. This universe consists of many strange mystical creatures. For example, Cthulhu is a squid-like creature, and all across Shadows of Evil you can see references to the Cthulhu creature. Now let's move on to the harvest pods in Shadows of Evil. These are the strange looking plants that when harvested will give you power-ups, weapons, parasites, or prime grenades. Now these pods are not just normal everyday plants, they are intelligent life forms, meaning they have brains and the ability to think, but they are also a form of super intelligence. These pods are the elders, or better known as the elder things in H.P. Lovecraft's writings. This here is a cipher that was decoded by Mr. Raffle Waffles on Shadows of Evil. The elders will continue to seed space and time, I must lead them to a place they cannot see. So it's from here that we can assume that the elders are extraterrestrial species that created the universe and continues to expand the universe. Now the quote is rather confusing, as how exactly do you plan to take an all-knowing species to a place where it cannot see? The answer to the question remains a mystery. Now let's go back to the harvest pods. Like I said, these pods are the elders and they seem to have taken over the city. Here's an audio diary from a reporter in the city talking about these pods. Then people started getting sick. At first it just made them delirious, confused. Then they really got sick. It was like they were wasting away. People finally started talking about it. I spoke to one guy in his 80s, a fruit seller at the local market. He said something similar happened in New England in 1882. When I tried to press him on it, he just lowered his head and ignored me. If you ask me, something definitely ain't right here. Now the story behind these pods is that they are an extraterrestrial species that came to Earth and built huge cities both on land and underwater. The Elders also created a species called the Shogoths, I think that's how you say it, I'm not quite sure, um, I apologize if I'm saying it incorrectly, which are essentially the Elder Things slaves. According to the mythos, the Shogoths led to the accidental creation of the Ubo Sathla, which was a godlike entity that was credited for creating life on Earth. However, it was also possible that the Elder Things created life on Earth as well. The other things are also known to have waged war against the Cthulhu and the Migu in the Migo. The parasites from Shadows of Evil, which are the flying insects, are based off of the Migo. Migo. The other things then later return to the ocean because of weather changes on Earth, and the other things cities then got taken over by the Shogoths, who got powerful. These Shogoths were the uh, slaves for the el for the elder things, so the Shogoths eventually took over the elder things and took over their cities. So the Elder Things are an alien race that appeared on Shadows of Evil by meteorites, and in the Cthulhu Mythos, they were the first extraterrestrial species to come to Earth. The Elder Things stand 8 feet tall, but in Shadows of Evil, they are much smaller and shown in a laid-back and simple form. It is possible that we will see the Elder Things in their more advanced stage in future Black Ops 3 DLC. Also, given the fact that these Elders resided in both land and underwater cities, you should expect an underwater zombies map in the future. Now we know that a lot of the current zombie story has to do with Richtofen trying to save the universe. We don't know what his plan is exactly, but I wouldn't be surprised if the Elder Things get in the way of Richtofen's plans. Maybe the Elders are the reason why this cipher states that Primus will fail. So with all this information, it's probably safe to say that we can predict Black Ops 3 Zombies DLC by looking to the writings of HP Lovecraft. I wouldn't be surprised to see an underwater zombies map, an evolved form of harvest pods, aka the elders, and a possible war between all of these gods slash extraterrestrial beings that I mentioned in this video. And apparently there is also another group called the elder gods, which are different from the elder things. The elder gods are made up of many different creatures, and together they are the elder gods. Anyways, that's it for today's video. Hopefully you all enjoyed. If you did, feel free to click the like button and subscribe if you've not done so already. Also, feel free to leave any questions or ideas that you have in the comments section below. Anyways, my name is Magic, and I'm out. Motherfuckers wanna get famous, bust guns that get dangerous, dangerous. Yeah, they graduated from Cambridge, yeah. Money talks in every language. Real recognize that stainless, stainless.